snap ring on this one went on the inside. There we go. Pardon my French. It is moving. I may be destroying it, but it's moving. That internal groove that holds the internal snap ring in place is really hard to see. It's right above the green down in the cylinder. It's a, let's see if I can get a shadow on it. There we go. And that uh, filler ring is going to go right in there. Okay. There's no good way to fill this. So this is the filler ring. If you look at it, a very acute angle and then it's, you know much less of a on this side so that sharp part has to point in so all you do just gonna cut off just a smidge you put it in that and you just kind of smooth it all the way around and it'll go in and there's an internal snap ring that it'll allow to get over that groove. And, uh, well, we'll see. We'll see. So here's my setup. This is anchored into this wood pretty good. Just got a little bit of, whatever you call it, hemp, <laughs> hemp rope. I got the filler ring inside there. And all I have it is a ratchet strap. And here's a pretty stout bolt that not only goes through this thick one but goes through the upright underneath it so it shouldn't pull out okay internal snap ring right here is why you need that filler ring but once you get it out you can throw it away well unless you mess up and have to do it all over again because you don't need this to go in just to come out I give this about a five percent chance of working yep zero percent chance I think I just lost my left testicle. Trust me when I tell you that takes a just a ridiculous amount of force. They don't want it coming off, that's for sure. Hmm, I wonder why it was leaking. Look at that. Brittle and busted.
Let's get this flat bushing out. Okay. Pretty straightforward that replaces that. You know, that went in real easy. I recall this is really sloppy last time I did it too. Held in by the corrosion. Alright, that's a circular ring. Well, that's the best I can figure. I got a serious case of the fumbles today. I don't think it's from the one Lone Star I drank either. Ah, nope. Damn it. There we go. More, three more to do after this, so I'll get a better shot to get it on. But uh, we'll see if I can get the old one off. Well, it wasn't terrible. It's actually in pretty good shape. I guess it's protected by that one, but... Fifty clean towels to do this, so I'm just just gonna deal with the comments, I guess. I'll be done. Now I've I've been told also that it it does stretch when you try to put this on. What I'll probably do here is get a couple hose clamps and uh, push it on this thing and just leave it overnight. That's already starting to settle back in. Seems pretty close to zero. That's what I think. No, we're not using the we're not using the right stuff, sorry. On there, damnation. I sure did not.
So I could put the snap ring on. There's Roger. Picking up his hay. So this is ready to go back on. Ooh, thank you, Lord. 